Hello, welcome to DIY Ideas. Today I'm going to show you how to make your own gloves for the winter. They're like a half, uh, yeah, half on your hands and half they cover your wrist. Uh, so you've got your four fingers in one one hole and then you've got a um, hole for your thumb. We're going to use the crooked needle and uh, yeah, they're quite thick so these are nice and warm for the winter. They're very easy to make as well. Uh, yeah, I'm really excited to show you guys how to make it. And uh, yeah, I've got the second one obviously here as well. And uh, yeah, let me show you how to do it. So we just uh, got grey fabric of grey wool. It's quite a quite a thick one. I uh, use scruffy needle six, and uh, yeah, it's 97% uh, wool and 3% polyester. And uh, it's like been weaved. It's like a it's like a big braided, big braided wool. Right. We're just gonna call. Start with half stitches, and we'll start with. Yeah, the length of your um, hand to wrist. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So I'm gonna go with twenty. So the legs, yeah, that's perfect. Both ends together. All right. So that's around your wrist. Right, two upwards. And then half stitches. I'm going to show you how to do all the rounds. That's about eight to nine rows that we're gonna do. And then, uh, yeah, obviously I'll guide you through. So yeah, we're doing these half stitches. Alright, so we'll just twist it around. Move it at the end. There we go. We just connect one side to another. There's the last stitch. Alright. Then I'm gonna go back to the first stitch. And let's see that. So yeah, now we connect both ends. So one quick pitch, and then we're going to continue with another round, just so we continue with half stitches. And then I'll show you the next round. So the second round is now done. There we go. So 
So you see the first stitch over here and the fixed pitch over there. So we're just going to go over that first pitch, uh, the fixed pitch, and we're going to go through that so that's connected and straight. Okay, one stitch upwards, and then a fixed pitch. Then we're going to continue half stitch. So there we go. It's a uh, round to be done. There we go. Just have a double check how it's looking. So there we go. This is like the wrist part. Obviously we need to make a little hole for your thumb. And I finish it up. So yeah, for me it's eight rows. For you it might be six or ten or completely depending. You can make them as long as you want as well. Alright, I'm gonna open leave three stitches open. So I'm just gonna go upwards. Three stitches upwards. And then I'm gonna go three stitches further. So this is where your thumb is gonna be. So I'm gonna three stitches upwards and I connect them three stitches further up. So I'm still staying in the same track. And we continue with half stitches. So, at the finishing, at the end of this round, we are with the, the part where you have to open for your thumb, right there. So, go into your first stitch that you've done for your thumb. Continue your half, uh, a fixed pitch. And then we continue with half stitches like nothing happened. Three, so that's that part done. And we continue. So this is for your thumb, and what we've done is just made three extra stitches and cross that over through well above the other three stitches and continue our crocket. So basically, you don't you don't have to do anything different; just leave it open essentially. Right. So it's past the thumb. We just need to make one more one more layer, one more row. And then, uh, yeah, they were there, I think. It's a nice length. And yeah, I think that's a good size. So we're just going to continue one more, one more row and then finishing off. So I'm almost, uh, I'm at, here at the third round after my thumb. So we're just going to try it on again in a minute to see if it's uh, to our liking. Let's finish off this row. One more half stitch. Alright, so let's try it on. There we go. Yeah, that's much better. That's a perfect, perfect length. Yep, I think that's really lovely. It's a good size, perfect size. I hope uh, you like it and you try it at home. Uh, if you if you like this video, please subscribe down below for our channel for free. And always be the first one to be informed about new videos. Um, yeah, I think it's a great idea for the winter. We've got loads of more videos about crocking, crocking, uh, yeah, knitting, DIY, crafts, everything. So have a look and we'll see you soon at DIY Days. Bye bye.